Gabriel Zinchenko. No, I swear to God, if we if we do concede against Chelsea, it's uh, I, I might cry. Yeah. Remember when Molina just reported the fact that there was like a missing player at Spezia, and like no one had talked about it. <laughs> Refs are worse now because they have a scapegoat. That's yeah, that's a fair th a fair way to look at it. Okay, better Arsenal. Much better Odegaard. Yes! Come on! That is a fucking brilliant finish by Martin Odegaard. My word! My word! Let me see that again! Please! Just give me the replay now! Dear Lord! The sex god is back. Officially, he is back. But at least, because I do have to get, like, a bunch of video scripts done tonight. Sing the Empoli song. The Empoli song is a banger. I, I can't even lie. Okay. Nice. Oh, god again? Oh, my god. This man is Cooking! Oh, that is beautiful! Oh, we'd love to see it! it the sex god is 100% back! I thought he was gone! He's gone from his little vacation, he's back! Maybe a little too late, but you know, it's alright! It's alright! It's 2-0! Two 2-0, nil. Two nil. this is the first time! Actually, no, the second time, really. The Arsenal have been winning a match! While I've been streaming, isn't also, that fucking crazy? As someone who did go for deep dish in Chicago for the first time last year, it's pretty good. Different, but good. That's fair, that's fair. I've always kind of imagined it as like... I don't know, like a fucking, like, lasagna or something. Like, or like, kind of like, um... A calzone, almost. Just like, extra sauce. Update the score, that's right, that's right, that's right, that's right. I, I will... I don't know if there will ever be a day that I remember an update score. Just there, that's a hard one to hit. But the smuggles over the top of it. Yes, boys. Yes. Yes, I don't have to be tortured today. Oh my god. Bliss. Bliss, in fact. They just understand each other. The ball at him. And now he's got a hat trick. Oh, here we go. Ah. It was never in doubt, guys. I never had the feeling that Chelsea would ever uh, score against us. Never, never. All right, this is this is Saka's time to come back. He he will take off his invisibility. It, yeah, invisibility cloak. Give your influence. <laughs> They were 2 0 up against the Liverpool. Okay, yeah, no, you're right. You're right. But this is Chelsea we're talking about here, okay? Like, I, I want to say pretty confidently that Chelsea aren't much of a problem. You know, but maybe that's like saying it too early. But, guys, it's fucking Chelsea. Jesus. Oh, that's a beautiful ball to Saka. Saka, cook. Cook Saka. Sorry. Xhaka. Odegaard. That was actually Jorginho. Ben White. Oh, oh, he still got it. Someone hit it. <laughs> oh my god. 3-0, 3-0, 3-0, and guess what? Guess what, you motherfuckers? I'm gonna remember, remember I'm gonna remember this time. I'm gonna remember. It's 3-0, it's 3-0 up in 30 minutes. <laughs> oh, this is beautiful. This is lovely. I'm, I'm in another plane of existence right now. Who cares? Who cares about the table right now? I'm in heaven. Look at all 
blue shirts edge of the box. <laughs> we stand behind Chelsea. <laughs> what a bridge right now. I don't even know what the hell was going on with their defense there. Absolute shambles. Five goals in the first 21 minutes. I mean, no, no, but this is this is pretty good. This is pretty good. This is pretty good. Ah, oh, this is just lovely stuff. Lovely stuff. Perhaps, perhaps there is still hope. Crazy how that is Jesus' tenth goal. That should really be, like, his 20th goal, knowing how many times he's, like, missed a sitter. Managerial 007 incoming. Absolutely brilliant. God, how, how much was it again, everyone? How much was it? Was that 100 million? 200 million? 300 million? No, 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 no. 400 million. We're getting there. We're getting there. 500 million. Ben Chilwell is about what? to go learn Chinese. 600 million. 600 million they spent. Oh my god, dude. It is always a wonderful day when you get to laugh at billionaires. What is what's happening here? Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, all right. So that's the first half. Very, very good half for, from the boys. Going McDonald's. Want anything? Mm, can I get like a eight-piece chicken nugget or ten-piece actually? Sorry, and um, you know a couple sweet and sour sauces. Throw in a McGriddle in there too. Fat Frank ruined my orba dagger. He will hear from me. <laughs> all right. Let us look at the ratings this time around. It'll actually be pleasing to look at. Oh, jeez, man. Just look at that. Granite Jocko with two assists. My lord, he is having a fun time. Jorginho's been pretty good. I would say his rating deserves to be a little bit higher. Saka, yeah, 6.9 is honestly a bit generous. Saka's just not looked good in the last month or so, which kind of sucks. Um, 5.9 Kepa, maybe should be a little lower. Azpeli Quetta has been getting cooked. On that on that left side, um, let's see. Maduweke has looked a little active, so I can Andrei definitely Hume understand Sterling that. Andrew gets the first red card of the match for diving, sponsored by the Red Cross. Sponsored by Red Cross. Oh boy. To be honest, should have benched Saka for Trossard. Yeah, I don't know. It's just it's it's weird. I think I would have liked Martinelli more than Saka because I thought Martinelli looked a little better in the last game. Not by much. Like, they both were not so great. Well, until Premier League starts putting logos in the middle of the circle like MLS. <laughs> Come on, Saka. This is it. This is the moment. This is the moment you shine. Fuck! I just want to see him fucking thrive, man. I want to see him be happy. I want to see the Saka smile that I haven't seen for like a month now. Will there be a vlog with Niren uh, since you're going to the UK? I, I'm not entirely sure. Uh, his schedule is very busy. I have nothing set like in stone in the UK. I just know like there's going to be things that happen and we'll just go from there. I'm probably going to document a good amount of my stuff on like Instagram because like, you know, I'm going to London. I'm sure you guys want to see what the fuck happens with like an American going to London. Uh, for Ryan, the first time ever. Ryan wins the Bundesliga BC, you deserve a trophy. No! No, you're gonna be fucking kidding me! No, we can see it against Chelsea! No! No! Oh, oh, we, is that another injury? Oh, that's lovely. That's fucking lovely. God damn it, we just conceded it. No, that's so shameful. That's so shameful. For the prime sub. Anyways, let's look at what we have here. Odegaard was fantastic. I thought Jaka was way better than a 7.9, me personally. Curio is really good. Um, Gabriel, where is Gabriel's rating? Yeah, I would say... Fair. 
Trossard was really good. Zinchenko was very good, although he was more so in the midfield. Um, Jesus looked a lot better in this game. Um, Martinelli just came on. Nelson came on. Saka with a 7.5. Thanks for coming back inside the studio with us, Paul Burmeister, alongside Robbie Earl and Robbie Musto. So for the Gunners, it's one step at a time, but mission accomplished today. They win. They look good doing it. We talked a lot before the match, Robbie, about how do the Gunners get back on the winning track? How did they do it today? They did it with getting back to the basics for them, which is I don't, I don't know how I feel about that one, I'll be honest. Mad. Not that they were pushed and pressed too much from Chelsea, <laughs> but the football was... I thought Kiryu deserved a better rating, too. Um... What else do we have here? We have Jorginho, yeah, 6.5 is totally fair. Uh, Saka, 7.5. I don't... I have no idea about that one, bro. <laughs> that doesn't seem right. Kepa to 7.1. Okay. Chalaba, Thiago Silva. Sure, I guess with the clearance off the line, I guess you can consider that. Aspeliqueta was still getting cooked. Conte, just really not the same as he was before. Makes sense. He's been out for so long. Um, Madueke was definitely like Chelsea's best player today. Like I would say he was the most threatening. He seemed to be the player that really made more like the most difference. I mean, he also got a goal. There was that too. Michael Burrow manager than Lampard? Easily, easily. I could easily steal Chelsea's job right here, right now. Lovely stuff, boys. Lovely, lovely stuff. What?